good morning good morning good morning how is everyone doing today i'm gonna have to like vlog like this because i feel like you know every time i put this camera on the tripod in the car um it's just i i gotta wait until i get tent to to be doing all that because i ain't really that advanced to be blurring out my surroundings and all that stuff and it just be showing too much be shaking it just be a whole lot a whole lot i'm kind of mad that i spent my 74 dollars on this tripod because i don't know i don't see it useful now if we get another car if we do god willing get a van so um i made the rookie mistake and forgot to bring my battery a backup battery but i do have my um battery charger in the car so that is good but anyway i just want to let you guys know that i am on my way to the doctor so i'm hoping that you know we get the gender stuff out of the way paper today david's not coming with me this time so there's no room for error i'm gonna go ahead charge my battery some and then come back to you guys in a little bit but right now before i do that i am on my way to nala's daycare because david forgot to get her uh formula and take it so i'm going there and plus she has a cold and give her medicine and all that so let me do that i'll update you guys as soon as i can i'll see you in the next clip all right y'all so i'm actually back sooner than expected i actually had to go back to the house because i realized that i left my debit card at home and i'm like i absolutely cannot leave and go so far throughout the day and don't have my debit card because i have to go by walmart and then um i just need to have cash on me so um walmart's one of the places that don't have samsung pay but that don't even matter anymore because i just realized sorry i had to stop um because usually i have a really 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 bad habit if you know me you know i do not carry purses much i always keep my cards in my pocket or something like that or in my bra or whatnot i never like to carry my card and it never really was a big deal because when i have my samsung phone i do samsung pay because everywhere takes samsung pay except for walmart walmart is another case so i wanted to make sure i had the card but i thought if anything i'll be fine because i got samsung pay but um i don't know if i addressed this on camera yet but i recently got the iphone 11 pro max and i am really really battling if i want to take it back or not there's a lot of things about the phone that i can get used to but one two things that's irking me is the samsung pay i won't have that anymore and i can't multitask so a lot of times now like now i am on my way to nala and going pretty far to go to my doctor's appointment and i always do gps and watch youtube at the same time i always have it in my dashboard and i literally glance on and off at youtube videos because it can multitask so with iphone you can't do that you can't multitask if you're watching youtube you watch youtube you probably can like surf the web at the same time i believe but the little picture will not be at the bottom i use that a lot i am a junkie youtube watcher like i watch youtube all day long all night long i have insomnia too so i also listen to youtube at night when i'm going to sleep which is another problem because um i wonder if there's an adapter with the iphone because a lot of times i have like alarms on my phone and i need to be charging my phone in the middle of the night but because i actually use headphones because nala sleeps in the room with us so i use headphones at night until i fall asleep and then sometimes she wakes up in the middle of the night then i still use them to put her back to sleep at the same time and the problem with that is that i can't be charging my phone at the same time as using my head jack i know i can usually get wireless earbuds but that becomes another problem because i have to charge the earbuds every single day when i'm using them at night which is the only time I use my headphones. So I feel like I'll be running into dead battery issues and 
stuff. I just wonder if there's gonna be like some type of adapter that accepts charging and a headphone jack at the same time. Like those three things is something that if I choose to stay with iPhone, which David wants me to because he feels like it would be really helpful with the whole YouTube stuff. Like I don't have to do this and grab batteries and do the whole charger thing. I can just use my phone a lot of times because the iPhone do have amazing battery life and great camera quality. Um, but I wonder if there's a way that at least for, ooh, at least for the Samsung Pay issue, I do have the Samsung um, watch if I can just connect that watch to David and just use Samsung Pay and add my card to it and just keep the watch for that case and then keep the iPhone. So I don't know, I'm really, really battling with that. Enough of Apple versus Samsung talk. I am almost at Nala's daycare. I got to give her, like I said earlier, her cough medicine, diapers, I mean wipes, formula, I just gotta stock her up, so I'm gonna do that, get in here, and then I'll be right back. All right, y'all, I'm back. So, surprisingly, she was asleep, so it's sad because I like to say something to her every time I go in. I feel so bad when I see her, and then I don't really get to touch her, hold her, kiss her, squeeze her, but I don't wanna disrupt her, and I don't wanna make stuff more difficult because there were other babies in there waking up from their nap screaming off the top of their lungs that type thing and she was feeding the baby who was hungry so i just did the i get it face i'm not gonna bother her because i don't want nala adding to it because every time nala wakes up she wants to eat and her eating habits been a little bit funny but i was gonna say was i'm surprised at all that i, I turned around went back home picked up the stuff I went to McDonald's I went to Nala's daycare and now I'm on my way to the doctors and I'm still gonna be early look at God right there so I'm kind of excited that I hope I get a good sonographer because then I want her to write down the baby's gender and then we could go ahead and get this gender prediction out of the way and then the gender reveal so I want to do all that this week also, I have bought this thing from Bath and Body Works, and I'm a little bit underwhelmed. So I got the little scented car little thing like that to make this car smells really good. And I don't, I don't know. Like I smell it like this, but I don't, I don't smell it in my car like that. I don't know if I'm doing something wrong, but I'm a little bit underwhelmed. Bath and Body Works has always done me great, but um, I don't smell anything. All right, you guys, so I know it's been actually several hours since I last spoken to you. I have gotten really tired at a couple of <laughs> other. Yeah, see, I'm home with baby girl. Yeah, don't grab my hair, she loves to do that. So I'm back home with David. David's home. He yep. had his first day at his new job. Yep. How do you feel? Good. You like your new job? Yes, yeah, good. You happy you transitioned? Mm-hmm. Got up out of there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. He he doing bit things now. <laughs> so I had quite a few doctor's appointments. I'm kind of blurry. Yeah, I had quite a few doctor's appointments as well as, you know, other appointments I had to go to. Then I got tired, then I had to eat, then I had to run out. It just been a whole lot, a whole lot, because I'm also planning a girls' night in weekend thing this weekend where David and baby Nala is going to go home. And I'm going to have the house to myself with me and the girls. So, I thought it would be good to go ahead since i actually do got the envelope with the baby's gender on it i'm gonna shake it like this so i don't want nobody trying to read through the line but i have decided that we're gonna go ahead and open it up together Woo! and in nervous so we just actually filmed a gender prediction video and that was very Enlightful, so go watch that video if you haven't already. I really did want to, <laughs> I really, really, really did want to do originally a 
a gender reveal situation. Everyone's been asking if we're gonna do a live elaborate party like we did for baby girl Nala, but unfortunately not. I'm not gonna do that. All right, so we had to get on the floor, child, because we hold parents around here. Whole parents. <laughs> but I thought, like I said, I originally wanted to do an elaborate, uh, elaborate gender reveal, but it's just too much, you know, especially with me having this baby so close to Nala's birthday, as well as like the baby shower and uh, actually delivering the baby. So I don't want to add any additional parties. Plus there's like Christmas, there's holidays. So I thought that if I can save any type of function, I don't want to spend any extra money than we need to. So we're going to go ahead and do this thing like a family. Yes, yes, yes. I'm a little nervous. My heart is beating. And your heart beating? I don't think so. I don't think so, you feel cold. <laughs> You know, you not nervous. I don't know, not really. A little bit. A little bit. My shoulder's starting to hurt. <laughs> so <laughs> the moment we all been waiting for, outside of having the actual baby child, I don't even want to open this. But we gonna do it. <laughs> uh, how should I do this? Just open it up, like towards them first, or us? Let them see first. So don't look at it. Yeah. All right, close your eyes. Sometimes they put a flap like this. I'm close my eyes, I can't see. Wait, I think this is an ultrasound. Okay, so it's a paper. Okay. One, One <laughs> two, two, three. three. Oh. <laughs> see that this whole time. Yay. It's a girl. David so hurt. <laughs> yeah, it's a girl. Right there, it's flat. I don't even know what I'm looking at. This is a butt. Oh, okay. This is like basically uh, look at the butt up. Gotcha. <sighs> so it's a girl. Got a girl dog. Got a girl baby. Got another girl baby. Got a wife. <laughs> I'm the only man in this house. <laughs> so everyone is wrong, you guys. It's a girl. It's another a, one. It's a girl. <laughs> it's so weird knowing now. It's a girl. Not feel like we could get pregnant again. Oh! I don't want to get pregnant again right now. <laughs> oh no! See, I told y'all if if we have another girl, David's not gonna feel done. Nah. He's gonna want another one. Look, see how comfy you sound? That's why we get in the van. He want Now we really gotta get a van. <laughs> Cause he want another one. It's two girls, so she's gonna have a sister. I don't know, there's a I part of- they gonna fight. There's a part of me thought that was really gonna, kinda like maybe we was gonna be wrong, it's gonna be a boy. But it's like, hey my heart of heart, I kinda knew it was a girl. Cause I just couldn't, I just couldn't see myself saying, Oh, I have a son and a daughter. Like, I want to say it, but I just couldn't see it into fruition. And it's true. It is a girl. It's a girl. Like, it's a girl. Now we can prepare the two girls. At least we ain't got to buy a lot of clothes. Yeah, at least we got that. <laughs> yeah. Now we got to come up with another girl name. It's going to kind of gonna have to kind of match now yeah. since they're so close in age. Yeah. It ain't gonna be Lala. We ain't doing that. No. <laughs> we it. ain't doing that. <laughs> so y'all, uh. we thank you guys for watching. We love you guys all so very much and we will see you guys in the next one. See you guys.